the Eclipse already includes the JUnit plugin so we can easily create unit tests using this plugin and have those tests executed using the JUnit framework. The first step should be choosing the class for which we want to create unit tests. In this case we shall select the class utils. The class utils includes a method, the method sum. Let's create another method to make the example a bit more interesting. So now we have two methods. The first is sum, the second is multiply. The first receives an array of int numbers and returns their sum. Uh, the second receives an array of int numbers and returns their multiplication. When creating unit tests, we actually create uh, for um, each method we want to test uh, a new method that includes tests specifically for the method we want to test. In this code sample we have the class utils so we want to have new methods one, two new methods, one shall include tests for the method sum and the other shall include tests for the method multiply. Working with JUnit each class that includes methods we want to test shall have a new class with the same name appended with the word test and that new class shall include for each one of the methods we want to test a dedicated method with the tests inside. So let's select utils.java right click the mouth and choose new and here we can find the other option where we can find inside the java category the junit category and here we can select the junit test case let's select next here we can select whether we want to work with the junit framework version 3 or version 4. As I explained before, for each one of the methods in utils we shall have a dedicated method that includes the tests. So if we want to test the methods sum and multiply the new created class test uh, units utils test shall include two methods dedicated for these two methods one shall be dedicated for the method sum and the other shall be dedica dedicated for the method multiply when we configure the tests we want to have. Here we can select which methods in addition to the two methods that shall be dedicated for the methods sum and multiply. Here we can select which methods in addition to these two methods shall be de defined in utils test. Set up and tear down these two methods are um, executed before and after each method defined in utils test that includes specific tests for a specific method in the original class. Uh, set up before class and tear down after class uh, these two methods are executed before and after all testing methods in utils test are executed. So setup before class exe is executed only once 
and the same with teardown after class which is executed after all tests are completed let's press next and here we can select the two methods in utils we want to test let's press finish in case that we still don't have the JUnit4 library available for the Eclipse IDE we can uh, add uh, that library automatically the plugin identifies uh, this problem and offers and suggests doing it for us so let's press OK and here we can see the new class utils test you can see that each method in this new class is marked with an annotation that has a very specific meaning